today I'm gonna do uh, what people assume about me video um, and I know I haven't posted on YouTube in a while because I've been really busy and I've been figuring out what I should put on my channel but I'm gonna just do this one because I know like it's popular right now so I'll just do that one but basically I'm gonna just read what people assume about me and I'm gonna say um, if it's true or not and I'll speak on it a little bit and yeah and so the first one it says that I got a boo but yeah I do talk to somebody and um, it is the white boy that y'all seen in that video but yeah but I mean like we don't go together yet but we just talk so yeah um the next one is people dislike you for being pretty basically um so i mean i really don't know about that one because um i know like i get comments about people saying that i'm ugly or that my hair is fake and people say like they think my hair is a wig because like my hair is wet, it's, um, you know, it's flat, it's not puffy at all. And then some folks say like it's fake because when I put my hair in a bun, it's so small and stuff like that. But people just don't know like that it is my real hair and yeah. I even did a whole YouTube about it of how I put my hair in a bun, so yeah. <clears throat> but yeah, it is my real hair though. The next one is you eat a lot but don't gain and that is true um i'm naturally skinny like i was born with fast metabolism because it runs in my family and stuff like that so it's very hard for me to gain weight um especially if i eat a lot but the problem is i guess is because i'm not eating enough calories so I am taking a medicine now that um, slow down my metabolism. It helps me eat more, and that is abdomen, um, uh, abdomen or pediment, you know, however you want to say it. But yeah, and it has helped me a lot. Um, it is definitely helping me gain weight, and it really does work slowly, but it's it's getting it's getting there. The next one is you're a very chill person. I am. I'm very chill. Like, when you see me, like, I really don't talk to anybody for real, for real. Like, I'm really just quiet. Um, somebody said that they assume that I'm stuck up. I'm not stuck up at all. Like, I don't think um, I'm all that and stuff like that. But, yeah, I really ain't like that for real, for real. Um... The next one is you're humble as fuck. I am. I really am humble. Um, I don't. I don't think like I'm better than anybody. Um, you know and all that. The next one is that I'm shy. I am shy for real. But um, when I get comfortable around you, then that's when I really open up more. Um, the next one is that I'm rich. I want to say that I'm rich for real, for real. I want to, like, I basically just have money enough to where I can afford stuff that I want because basically I have a job and I make money off Instagram and I'm about to make money on YouTube now too, so. But I'm not rich though, but like my parents, um, they both have jobs. Um, and they are able to keep a roof over my head and um, <clears throat> buy stuff um, for me. But yeah, the assumption is your parents ain't strict. Actually, my parents is strict, but they ain't as strict as they used to be. They really, um, they really let some of the strictness go away a little bit. But they, they still strict like. They still strict on saying, like, I'm not allowed to have a boyfriend until I go to college because they really want me to focus on school and um, go to college because they feel like, you know, if I have a boyfriend, then I might end up getting pregnant or, um, you know, just 
other stuff that wouldn't be able to get me into college. So yeah, <clears throat> I mean, I really don't blame them for that. I don't mind them, you know, that, but they really, um, they don't mind me talking to people now though. But I do end up telling them like who I talk to and stuff like that. Um, and they is strict about me letting go, like letting me go somewhere. Like they really don't let me go to parties and stuff like that. And like they'll sometimes ask me to turn on my GPS and stuff like that. So yeah. Um, a assumption is that I'm 15. I'm not 15. I'm 16. Somebody said that I live in Atlanta. I don't live in Atlanta. I stay in the country. And I stay in the south. So I stay like an hour and a half from Atlanta. But yeah. I get a lot of compliments about my hair. Um, yeah, that is true for for Because anywhere I go, people would tell me that my hair is pretty. And yeah. Um, the next assumption is that I work hard for what I want. That is very true. I really do work really hard for what I want. Because I like, you know, like I said, money really motivate me to do stuff. Because, you know, I really want a lot of stuff, but, you know, I'm not able to get it because I feel like I don't want to spend um, so much money that I really don't need. You know, it's basically just something that I want. But, um, yeah. But all I got to say is if I want it, I'm going to get it. So, yeah. Another assumption is you get high on the low. I have never smoked before ever in my life. So, nah. The next one is I don't have a lot of girlfriends. Your twin being your best friend. I don't have a lot of girlfriends at all. I only have, like, I have a best friend. So, that counts for one girl as a friend. And... I don't, I don't really mess with females because females are messy. It's, they just like to create drama and stuff like that. Especially um, some girls at my school, they are very messy. So yeah, I don't really fool with a lot of, a lot of that stuff. Um, I seem like I don't like having a lot of friends. That is true. Um, I mean, I really just, I really just, I really just don't like having friends to be honest. Having a lot of friends, but I do have a couple. It's like I have like five or six friends that I hang out every day with, and that's it. Um, another one is that I'm popular. I mean, people know me, but I don't, I wouldn't say that I'm popular, but people just know me. Um. The next one is that somebody said that I'm spoiled. I am spoiled for real, for real. I am. Um, but, I mean, I'm spoiled, but, you know, my parents also taught me that, um, you know, to work hard for what I want. So, yeah. The next one says that you get a lot of dudes. I can't even cap on that one. Like, I really do get a lot of dudes, but I really don't be interested in it for real, for real, because... Most of these folk be lying to me, so. Another one is that I'm short. I am short. I'm 5'1". Um, and then one says, um, you're nice as fuck and would, and would never catch an attitude unless you have to. And that is true. I'm very nice. Um, I really am nice. For real, for real. Um, but, like, the only time I catch an attitude is if I'm really, if I'm really ir irritated. If I'm really irritated and, um, or I don't feel like, you know, or I feel like some, like when people bother me, when I don't want to be bothered and stuff like that. So, yeah. And that's really when I really get an attitude. Or like when people say something, um, say something to me in a negative way. Then, yeah, that's when I really get an attitude. Um... One says that I'm confident. I mean, I wouldn't say that I'm really confident, to be honest. Because I still um, feel insecure about myself. Like, I feel insecure about my body. Like, how I'm, like, I'm so skinny and stuff like that. But I'm not that, um... I'm not that sensitive about, like, 
how like how I look, um, like how I used to be, but um, I really gotten over that a little bit, a little bit now. So yeah, <clears throat> that I don't get along with any. And I really don't get why people think that I don't get along with Inya. And if you don't know who Inya is, Inya is my twin sister. Um, but yeah, I get a lot of that to be honest. People think like I don't talk, to, I don't talk to Inya or I don't live with Inya. <laughs> and I guess because I don't ever post her or whatever. But y'all gonna have to get some straight, okay? Curly Headed is a page about me and only me, like. I did have a page about me and Inya, but somebody had that page. So yeah, so it's not like I don't get along with Inya, cause I do. She's my sister. So um, yeah, just don't just don't be thinking like that. But I really do get along with my sister. I be with her every day, 24 seven. So yeah, I do get along with her. The next one is you have good grades, so you get what you want from your mom. I mean, that's how it used to be when I was younger, like when I was in middle school. But now, um, my parents know that I get good grades anyways, but I still get spoiled every now and then, so it really don't matter if I do have good grades or not. So, yeah. Okay, somebody says that they assume that I'm hella mean. I'm not, I'm not mean at all, I swear I'm not. I'm really nice, but like, I only get mean Mm, I only get mean when somebody talk to me in a negative way or disrespect me. That's the only time I get mean, I swear. Um, yeah. And I'll be mean to, like, boys and stuff like that. Like, if I talk to somebody, that's when I really be mean and stuff like that. But, yeah, I'm really nice for it, for it. Somebody said I can be insecure about my hair sometimes. I mean, I love my hair. I love my hair to death. My hair is the love of my life, to be honest. So I'm not insecure about it at all. And one says, you don't give a fuck what people have to say. That is true, for real, for real. I mean, you know, some people would tell me, like, oh, um, because, like, when I say, like, I don't care, people would be like, oh, you do care because you said something about it and stuff like that. Like, I really don't know, man, like, I know that I said, like, I don't care, but, you know, um, I tend to have to say something so people would know, like, um, so people would know that I don't play about certain stuff. So that's really the only reason why I really say something. But, yeah, somebody said you're really smart. People tell me that so much, especially at school, because people tend to ask me to, um, look at my paper and stuff like that so yeah i really think i'm smart like but not in math though i'm horrible in math i'm not smart in math at all so. um one says am i straight i'm straight and forever will be straight i would never date no girl or nothing like that. um i have little siblings i do have um a little brother and that's it. This one right here. This one says you don't like working at McDonald's. That is facts. Right there, bro. I do not like working at McDonald's at all. I mean, I did like it for like one or two days when I first started. But then now it just really get me so irritated. It just don't make no sense. Like, I come home so tired, man. And I be so irritated because of dealing with people at work. I'm finna get my license. I'm finna just find me a whole nother job because... I do not like working at McDonald's at all no more. The other one is you don't really like Georgia. You right because Georgia is just lame. It's just really lame to me. And I really just want to go away. <laughs> um, you sometimes think about cutting your hair. I mean, I have before. Um, but I don't want to mess it up to be honest. So I just don't do it. One says, you will be the prettiest girl on Instagram if you're not already. I definitely won't be the prettiest girl on Instagram because there are other pretty girls too. You know, just like I said, I don't think I'm better than anybody. So, yeah. One is, you think all hair types are pretty. 
I do think that for real, for real, because sometimes I be thinking like, I want long straight hair, because I feel like, you know, it looks good on like so many people, and I feel like, oh, I really want that too. So yeah, I think, but I really do think all hair types are really pretty. Um, one says you cuss in front of your parents. My parents do know that I cuss, um, but they, they really don't say nothing about it to be honest. But yeah, but I don't cuss in front of them though. But one says you get away with anything. I wouldn't say any. I mean anything to be honest. But and, and now the last one is you mean as fuck, but I think it's your hair to be honest. I really don't get how am I mean because I have a lot of hair. I don't, I don't get how, I don't get that at all. But like I said, I'm not mean at all. And yeah, I don't think I'm better than anybody, none of that. But if you say something, say, say something to me in a negative way, then yeah, I, that's the time I'll get mean for real, for real. Cause like, I'm not the type to talk about nobody. I'm out my own business. And all of that. So when you talk, ba when you talk, ba like when you talk down on me, then that's gonna make me feel some type of way, and then I will talk down bad on you. So, but just like I said, I come hard. I come really hard when you say something about me. But yeah. So that is it for the video. Like, subscribe, share. And I'll see y'all in the next video.